to be sincere i don't understand how emotionally drained south africa people are before i don't normally take them seriously because i thought they are just trying to protect their country but now i understand better following chidema up and down like a lost dog is confusing you guys don't want her no problem nigerians need her now so please ne neophobians <laughs> arrest okay Rest Chidema needs time and space to understand Nigeria better and watch how she will bring the universe home. Thank you, South Africa, South Africa for giving her the spotlight. Are you people that wicked? This person said, I have told them the same thing. I can never understand them honestly. And that person said, Chidema Vanessa has one of the most, she has one of the most beautiful smiles in the world. Do you see how we we all come people, regardless of their backgrounds, very demure. <laughs> ah, very considerate. This is they say haters make you not, make you famous. Everybody need them. This one say, Chichi, please come home and fight for your right. You were born here, growing here. Not all of us hate you. Many of us love you. That that they wait to and whatever whatever spoke their language then this other person said um congratulations to south africa for making the right choice next time don't allow this niger ashawos to participate in your pageant let them represent themselves in their own oma oma niger proud country next you see <laughs> where these people come for us like this we don't talk but the day we come we come hard Anyway, some of them are already crying on my comment section and I don't care. This person says, beautiful girl, Chidima has a gorgeous smile. And that person says, South Africa, he says, South Africa is a stupid. <laughs> South Africans, okay, South Africans are so stupid. They don't let go of a golden pot of gold because of their pride. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in USA. A sharing, I don't know what this person is typing, sharing for Chichi. She has the total package to win. This person is a South African who lives in the U.S. writing this on this particular channel. He said, bitter, bitter about what stupid actually. I am happy because of the hard work done by the intelligent, responsible GNU, which could have been discovered by the useless ANC party government for bloody 23 Yes, being in power. Okay, guys, you know it's very funny how somebody is born in your place and grew up in your place. And now you are saying the person is not supposed to contest, is not fit to contest. Make it make sense. Didn't um this man, what's his name? The former go uh, former uh, president of US, Barack Obama. Where is Barack Obama from? He's not he's not from America. Obama is from I think Kenya. But they allowed Obama to contest. They allowed Obama to contest as an American president. And Nigerians supported Obama. But what are we getting now? You saw that Ricky, one guy who came from uh, Kenya and was talking rubbish. I, I had to respect my friends in Kenya and also people I know that are from Kenya that their head is correct. That was why I spoke about it and left it. Because I told him that if he tried that rubbish again, I was going to drag Kenya. And I've seen that he has not commented or said anything again. So, I don't understand how somebody is born in your place. Okay, for example, now I relocate with my children to Canada. and Or maybe I give birth to my children in Canada. And you think they don't have right. That is why you see that these first world countries are doing and making it. Because how do you explain somebody who is born in your place? Everything she knows is your place. You not tell her that she's not she's not from South Africa. You don't know her. You start saying she's this, insulting her, calling her names anyway. This one say fear of identity theft. How? This one say girl buy stay in the Nigeria and there. And you know they are English and you struggle to read it. This one say irony is the irony is that one two white farmers have been arrested for more for taking the lives of black women who they attacked during the holiday spot by grown white men because they were swimming where they said it is for white poor only that is let me read it again so that you understand they said two white farmers have just been arrested for murdering i didn't want to use the word 
for ending the life of black women and feeding them to pigs. Two, some black kids were attacked at a holiday spot by grown white men because they were swimming where they said it is for only the whites. So, South Africans, see him, Nigerians are not your problem. These white people in your country that makes you look like a second citizen and they are the first are your problem, not Nigerians. This person, he, the person continued, but number three, he said, Terry Blanche, who by black people and his supporters who are still alive, hate black people. They say South Africa is theirs and black people must live. Eh? Yet, Chichi is a huge problem has caused so much anger now wow wait 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 they say south africa is their country is for them and black people must leave yet chichi is a huge problem and has caused so much anger what they are trying to say here is that all of these things plaguing south africa they didn't see it to fight it is chichi who is a black like them that is not even telling them that they should... Chichi is not even a problem to them. They are fighting her just because she's a Nigerian. South Africans, you people will, will soon tell us. I think maybe this will be the last video I'll do about South Africa because each time I read all of these things, I'm wondering, are you people really human beings? That all this is happening is really sad, but what can we do? Now, someone said... He said, someone said, drop the link, please. So this person wants to go to that place to watch and see all that had happened in that place another person said cool presenter it's my first time to see you and i already love you the person that was interviewing chichi this person said in is this this video in this this video this is what the person said though so as i'm reading i'm reading according to what they are writing it is such it's just amazing when listening to Chidima mentioning that she entered the miss beauty contest in south africa but unfortunately she didn't win this really just demonstrates how the ANC party government, together with the Miss Beauty contest, failed to check Chidima's citizenship document then. As the ANC party government doesn't care any about their any activity which happens in South Africa as their only interest was the corrupt corruption which was going on day in day out as important issues were only about them the chidi massacre should have been discovered last year instead of this year it is just one of the obvious reasons why the anc shouldn't have appeared absolutely where near the government scenario um there is the therefore i would like to say that the south african committee they owe a very big thank you to the GNU as many wrong things which were missed by the ANC party government are being discovered and reviewed through their collective searches which now which would have definitely been even better with the absence of ANC party government inclusiveness which we have we hope that the U, the, the GNU will keep <laughs> We will keep on discovering even more of such corruptions which are ignored by the ANC party government. And somebody replied her, I think you are just bitter. Exactly. This person said she must stay where fraud is tolerated. Identity theft, she knows she won't cope in South Africa anyway. We don't need identity thieves. This is a South African woman who talking to Chidima. Somebody now replied her. He say it pain it, it pain you that you are you are feeling pains. You better don't you better don't enter your master's farm land. Oh. You know what happens to your sisters just a few days back. Bruhaha, you no go see sleep over Niger, and your masters will still pay dog hunt with you guys when that must be a sad one. The person is saying that she this lady is here fighting Chidima when their own fellow black women have been pied in their own country and that she should be careful as she enters so that they don't buy her also they don't end it for her as the way they did it for those women at limpopo this the other person replied and said the irony is number two okay we read that this person said never look back stay there and find a true id girl you do you 
you will do just fine. Don't forget to bring our ID and passport. We need it. Hey, yeah, South Africans, people are really very bitter. And I pray. Not all, though. Some of the South Africans, that their head is still correct. Eh? You are out of this whole thing I'm talking about. You are not part of it. This one says, why did she come out like this in South Africa with her legit documentation to defend herself? This one says, be strong. The people in South Africa who hated on you are the true losers. Exactly. This one says, every time she says that is amazing, I get confused. <laughs> This one say Nana, we rejected the corruption ANC government that makes you think you were going to be applauded for your being beneficiary of corruption. You must, whatever, you know you can't return here because you have no identity. Ah, ah, these people are wow. What is in South Africa that is about this identity back and forth? Like what? You see why some people tell you marry from your hometown, marry from your country because. This kind of rubbish is too much or stay in your place see even during the xenophobia why didn't they why didn't chidima's parents leave they know these people don't like anything in nigeria they don't like it this person say i really hope that she would have sorted out her identity first and then compensed competed so that she would have had a stress-free journey this one say Ch chidi spread your wings and fly your story might inspire young people around the world how a young lady despite the negativity she got she never let it get on her way of her dreams exactly she won after all this one said all black south african women have been slept by nigerian men way i don't know that one this one said come back investigation in progress you wish this one say her family let her down in the biggest, biggest way. Yet she says they are her biggest supporters. Is she not angry with her mother? Where, where's her baby? Mm -hmm. This one say, God bless Nigeria. I would like to forever. This one say, keep going, sweet girl. We adore you from Durban, South Africa. You got this precious. So, not all South Africans are against Chichi. A lot of them still love her and adore her. This person said, I have been following her story. I hope she gets proper help, not only beauty pageant-wise, but also mentally, physically, physiologically. Chichi, you are loved. And on behalf of South Africa, I am sorry this happened to you. Oh, that's so sweet of you. This person said... Um, as a South African who is rooting for Chichi, we love you, girl, and are rooting for you and voting for you. Much love to Nigeria. You see, there are some South Africans that don't like the rubbish that is going on. They still love this girl. They still love Nigerians. And that person said, eloquent, smart young girl, lesser focus, and considering the PR good or bad, she is cleaning it. A little rest and pampering should sort out the rest. This one says she looks different from her pictures. You other person say try to scam South Africa and saw flames. Hey, yeah, you will be fine. She doesn't look like a thief like you because people think everybody is a thief like you. This person said, um, now we know that Chidema doesn't take it easy on her haters. She doesn't too, and that is why they played that song. I'm not gonna take it easy on my haters. I'm gonna I'm not gonna take it easy on my haters. She said that's her favorite song. Of course, you know who she's referring to. This one said her parents should have told her from the beginning that she was Nigerian. This identity crisis would not be them. It was her parents who told her lies that she was both. A South African and Nigerian. That is what caused identity crisis. How can you be both nations when you were only birthed by the nations? This is foolishness. Hey, yeah, South Africans. I didn't know that you were, especially you that wrote this thing. Just as some of you use this thing on your names, I would have called your name there. When you are born in a place in Nigeria, when you are born in Nigeria, you can contest an election in Nigeria. So I didn't know that you people did not know all these things. Please, South African should government should educate his people because it's her people because this is rubbish. This one said the interviewer is fake. Oh, right, slick. The the fakeness is loud. Oh, you see, South Africans are also attacking the interviewer. 
that says a lot about them this one says thank you chidima for being where you belong nigeria nigeria as it might even help you to adopt the nigerian accent which might push you push a, a sympathy on you to win the miss universe beauty contest while it will be a way of saying sorry to you by the miss universe beauty contest judges for confronting you for the hell the south african government and its community had put you under and a very good luck to you that somebody now said her has her accent is already okay and that person said she is not even apologizing to the um person she stole her id she has nigerian to fall back at which is a different case for her this person now said chichi did not steal anything her mother from Z mozambique bought the id for her so chichi nigeria has nothing to do with that <laughs> some people said sometimes blessings come in disguise one day you will have your ahana moment aha moment what you think is a cause is actually a blessing this other person said chidema is darker than she is in her country the sun is too hot shame poor woman she is not used to fan running 24 hours <laughs> see see south africa that had serious low shading months ago they couldn't even power their diff their freezers this one said she is honestly riding on the thing that it will fade out do but wait why are south africa so angry nobody dislikes her but anyway i wish i could thank her because her situation exposed her own mother and their other south africans mm -hmm. okay excuse me somebody say haibu this girl is a narcissist she really doesn't give a damn about what her mom did to her south african sisters who couldn't register her child all in the case about herself yeah so Chilima is not a narcissist. Haba, you push you have sense now. Nah. How is she a narcissist? A child that no matter what you people did to her, she did not still call you names. Eh? So you say something is, is definitely wrong with here. What is wrong? Chidima is a blessed child. She's a Nigerian. And I'm so I'm surprised that South Africans travel to the UK and claim citizenship and claim citizenship in Canada and, and uh, America. Yet in their own place, they begin to misinterpret it what a shame big shame on you south africans shame